Welcome back, everyone. A ticket blitz today as PPA started handing out those tickets for residents who didn't move their cars for the street sweepers. That's right. This comes as the city enters a new phase in cleaning the streets, and primary voters get ready to make their choice for the next mayor on who should help clean up the city. Our Dan Snyder followed Cruz this morning. He's live in Point Breeze right now with more. Good afternoon, Dan. Yeah, good afternoon, Siafa and Natasha. We were on this street right here, 24th Street in Point Breeze, a few hours ago, and we watched as dozens of cars got hit with tickets just like this one right here. Now, PPA says its officers gave out more than 3,000 tickets across all 14 of these sweeping zones. The city says this is all in an effort to clean up that trash off the streets. But residents we talked with, they weren't very happy about the heads up they got. How much you ticket for? 31 bucks. Tickets left and right down 24th Street in Point Breeze this morning as enforcement started on the street sweeping program. And not everyone we talked with got the memo. They left paper on everyone's cars like months ago saying, hey, we're, you know, you got to start moving your car on Mondays. They hung the signs, but nothing has started and no one really knew that today was the day. We followed parking authority officers down 24th from Catherine to Wharton. In those seven blocks, officers ticketed 35 cars, more than $1,000 in fines in the half mile stretch. Still, some who live on the block are happy to see the sweepers. I think the street cleaning would be helpful. I think some people are, are against it, though, obviously, because. In certain parts of the neighborhood, it's difficult to find parking. This marks phase three of Mayor Kenny's mechanical cleaning program, targeting 14 neighborhoods that the city says have the highest concentration of litter according to its litter index. But Kenny's potential successors are looking to do more. The top five Democratic mayoral candidates in last week's Committee of 70 poll all mentioned cleaner streets as some part of their platform. But Adam Turner in Point Breeze says clean streets aren't a high priority for him at the ballot box. The streets can get clean, but we need a lot of other cleaning up that needs done. You know, drugs and stuff like that. People on the corner selling drugs. Others were just looking for changes to the current system. Typical Philly, you know, backed up, backed up, and, you know, they just kind of do things when they want, how they want. So, looking forward to a new mayor. Now, make sure you keep an eye out for these street sweeping signs in your neighborhood. That street sweeper could be coming to you and or you could be ending up uh, with that $31 ticket like a lot of these cars we saw here. You can find that full street sweeping schedule uh, on our website, cbsphiladelphia.com. In Point Breeze, Dan Snyder, CBS News, Philadelphia. Back to you. Going to be a lot of unhappy people out there seeing those tickets, Dan. Thank you so much. We appreciate it.